Hi guys, here we are for another quick tutorial. In this video I will show you how to create a copper metal uh, material in Cinema 4D and V-Ray. So let's begin. First of all I wanna use this copper downloaded by te uh, sketchuptexture.com to create my copper material. So to do this I create a new advanced material as usual. and drag and drop my texture in my specular layer okay I wanna decrease the brightness of my diffuse layer to 5% because the metals are a very dark diffuse and start to play with this the Fresnel IOR of the copper is about 2.5 at maximum value and now we have to play with this reflectance value here to do this I apply a Fresnel material to it to increase the shininess of it and start play with it with some values something like this works very well sorry I... I think this is good and now I'm gonna play with the texture because it's too uh, noisy here we have some differences of oranges and I don't like this so to do this to reduce this contrast in the texture I will now use a layer here and, and a color shader with some oranges texture on it put the bitmap on top of it and start play with the values to create uh, the desired effects I think 35 and multiply works well for me something like this 50% and reduce a bit the color of there we are. Something like this could be good. Okay, now last thing to do is reduce a bit the reflection glossiness to have a more realistic look. Apply it to my sphere, and I think we have to set it up properly with the tiles of two, and see what happens in our render. Okay, as you can see, we have uh, good uh, results. I want to increase a bit the, the realism of it by adding this, the same map in the BAM map to increase a little bit of noise on this metal. So stop the render. Go to BAM map. drag and drop on it so this texture so, okay go to filter reduce the 
saturation down to zero and also reduce a bit the contrast right minus 20 percent okay and set I want to apply also my texture here and mix a bit to create a little bit of variation also in the diffuse layer. As you can see here, it's not perfect uh, black. Okay. Let's see what happens. Delete this one. As you can see, compared by with the previous one, I have a little bit of light comes through my materials and it's also some noisy reflection here that's why I use a band map in, uh, in my shader to increase his realism I think a good st this one is a good copper for architecture and design visualization I hope you enjoy and follow me on Instagram and here on YouTube bye